Okay, you see these little blue things? They have taken over the internet, okay? It's like a virus that has permeated into every social platform that there is. <clears throat> Hi there, beautiful. How's it going? So, unless you have lived under a rock and you don't follow any beauty influencers anywhere, you might have not heard of Sugar Bear Hair, but otherwise, I'm sure you all know the scam that is Sugar Bear Hair. And if any of you out there are like, no, Brad, it works, just shut up. Go home. And if you are home, just walk outside. I don't know. Do something dangerous. Don't do anything dangerous. You know what? It's fine. Just just watch the video, okay? Please don't hurt yourself. I really don't want it. Like I I, I don't I'm not trying to get sued here. I I'm, I'm just a, I'm just a kid making YouTube videos, please. So I held off making this video for a long 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 time. And that is because as much as you know, I shit on people. It's the only way to put it. I shit on people's lives in my videos a lot. I try to be a lot of bit nice about it, but I'm genuinely just shitting on people's lives all day. When it comes to hair care brands, I try to not burn bridges. Because you know what? One day I am gonna have my own brand and I'm not trying to get shit on every day of my life, but I'm sure I will anyways, so. And I just spit on the table. So that's my life. You know, I did a video on the Korea clip. Sorry, Kriya, Miss Kriya, I'm sorry for that video. And I did a video on when, um, sorry, Chaz Dean for that video. And Sugar Bear Hair, <laughs> I am now sorry for this video. I know it hasn't started yet, but I am already sorry because I'm gonna just demolish you. <laughs> just kill it, just, just, just uh, you know? Just, just, bleh, just dead, just like bleh. I was scrolling through the Instagrams like I do like I do a lot. Oh my god, hashtag relatable. All right, so I was scrolling through Instagram and I haven't actually watched this video yet. I, I saw it without the sound on and we're gonna watch it together. I'm gonna do a little react for you right now. It is Kylie Jenner. She is doing an ad for Sugar <laughs> Bear Hair and she does a lot of these ads, all right? And every time they just seem like, well, why don't you just see for yourself first? How about that? Sugar Bear Hair is one of my favorite hair care secrets and they are delicious. <laughs> they are cruelty free, vegetarian, and gluten free. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> As for my bleach hair, they have been a necessity for me, so if you want to try, swipe up. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Becca Jenner, listen, before I get more into, you know, the real tea, I just want to say, Sugar Bear Hair, if you're watching this, I can easily change my mind about this brand and, you know, make another video saying how much I love your product. Um, if you're willing to pay me as much as you pay Kylie Jenner, um, which is probably like in the millions, uh, I'm guessing a million dollars for that one little 10 second ad. So Sugar Bear Hair, I'm here, I'm a sellout, I'm ready to take your money and make a video about it. Okay? <laughs> and of course you guys, the, their tagline on Google is revolutionary hair vitamins. Are you f kidding me? Are people, people are believing this. How can you make stupid people buy your stuff? You put the word revolutionary in something and people will buy it. Not saying I never will do that because I probably will, but it's good marketing, all right? I, honestly. So here we are. Oh, God damn it. The fact that people think that this shit is gonna grow their hair. I mean, it's a goddamn gummy bear. A gummy bear. A very <laughs> chic, very cute gummy bear. However, still a gummy bear. And I mean, do I wanna put this thing in my mouth? Yes. Do I want to put a lot of things in my mouth? No, actually. Honestly, I really don't like things in my mouth. On it, like, sorry. A regular hair vitamin um, that's vegetarian. Okay, why isn't it vegan? Oh, they probably have gelatin in it, which is like bone marrow. I'm disgusting, right? If you guys ever eat anything, anything that's gelatin-based, like gummy bears, it has bone marrow in it. That might not be like totally correct, but I'm 99% sure it's disgusting. So. My vegans out there, just 
Leave a comment. I mean, is that what it is, bone marrow? For healthy hair, eat the blue bear. For total body care, eat the pink bear. Holy shit. Our ingredients, let's look at this. Effective ingredients. Okay, here on Sugar Bear Hair, we strive for maximum safety and maximum results. Our products are manufactured in the US. <coughs> Almost burped. Our products are manufactured in the USA in facilities that are FDA approved guidelines to ensure quality and safe products. For your peace of mind, we use only the best ingredients available to ensure an effective product that looks great, smells great, and tastes great too. Most importantly, everyone says it, it works. I am so shook that I just got through that entire paragraph without stuttering because I am not a good reader. Like my ass in high school, like when they call me to read books, I was like, the goose, Hop, hopped over the fence. <laughs> like it was, it was wrong. It was, it was bad. Sugar bear hair ingredients. Our vegetarian vitamins contain vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin D, vitamin E, vitamin B6, folic acid, vitamin B12, biotin. Which I don't fucking care, honestly. Uh, choline, I, I tosyl. I don't even know what the fuck it is. The gummies are made with real coconut oil, dash of sugar. Bitch, hold up. Let me just, <laughs> this says a dash of sugar. I don't know about you, but to me a dash of sugar is like, pink. I'm gonna do that again. Pink, pink. Hold on, that was a bad one. Pink, okay, that was good. Okay, so three grams of sugar. All right, listen, the amount of sugar isn't that bad. Though, sugar is never good for you, okay? Just, it's just not, it's just not, it's just not. Three grams of sugar, there's about four grams of sugar in a teaspoon. So if you eat this entire thing, you're basically eating like a spoonful of sugar. You probably, you know, the girls that order this probably eat like five of them a day and they're like, oh my God, my fucking hair is growing back, like, Aah! And then they order more and more and more. And that is why Sugar Bear Hair makes so much goddamn money and I'm so jealous. Let's watch some review videos, shall we? Hey guys, it's Alyssa and welcome back to my channel. Today I have kind of an exciting video for you guys. Um, I just want to start by saying no, this is absolutely not sponsored at all. Ooh, this is 100% my own opinion. So Ooh, we're gonna have a tea in this video then. Honest review, this is the right one for you guys. I wanted to take this video because researching hair products that I wanted to grow my hair, it was kind of like, there were just so freaking many. So I figured I would try this one for you guys. I know it is endorsed by the Kardashians and I saw so many reviews online for it. Some people say it doesn't work, some people say it does. So I decided to give it a try for myself. So this is the first day I'm gonna be starting it. This length is just like an awkward length for me. I had my hair really, really long and then I just cut it straight up to my shoulders. Okay, I got a ruler. <laughs> So that's okay, a lot of my hair. <laughs> I lost that now, precise measure. My hair is completely straightened right now. I just, anyways, overall, I feel like my hair has grown. Um, I'm not sure. You guys will see. Um, I will put the clips side oh, by side. So you guys can see the difference. Um, I feel like my hair has grown. We're gonna measure it. I have the same exact ruler that I used last time. Um, last time my hair was just a little bit longer than 12 inches, like maybe like a centimeter or two. So we're gonna measure it again. Looks about the same. Maybe a, maybe like a centimeter or two longer. Okay, yeah, I would say maybe like a centimeter or two. It looks I don't understand this review. Your hair grows naturally. I mean <laughs> It's gonna grow, even if you don't take the vitamin, in a month, it's gonna grow a half an inch, usually, around a half an inch a month for everybody. So, this review would've been a lot better if you did a comparison between you not eating the vitamin for a month and how long your hair grew, and then you eating the vitamin for a month and seeing how much longer your hair grew than the month before. This review literally means nothing. My issue with this is not that it is bad for you or that it's harming you. It's not that. My issue with vitamins for your hair is 
If you just eat right and you drink some water and you do a little fitness and you just, your hair will grow so damn fast. However, genetically speaking, if you just have genetic problems with your hair, just like people have bad skin, your hair is just never gonna grow that healthy, okay? You can do as many things as you want. You can eat these dumbass sugar bear hair vitamins. You can work out, you can do, eat right. You can be vegan, you can blah, 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 blah. It's only gonna help you so much. <sighs> I know that's frustrating, but that's why we made hair transplants a, a thing, okay? That's why we have modern technology to give you a hair transplant. I just feel like it's a huge waste of money to buy these hair vitamins. When you could, you could just help your entire life by eating right and by staying active and by drinking water instead of spending your money eating sugar. No, right, it really works. And I'm like, really? no, it doesn't. <laughs> there is something in life called a placebo. Do you know what the definition of a placebo is? Why don't we just look it up so I can get the real definition for you. Placebo. <sighs> placebo, I spelled it wrong because I am illiterate. Um, a harmless pill, medicine or procedure prescribed more for the psychological benefit to patients rather than any physiological effect. So basically, if you didn't understand that either, because I didn't get it, I don't know what that just said. Say you're taking sugar bear hair and you and your head are thinking, this sh is the dopest. Oh my God, like it tastes good. Oh my God, like my hair is growing, my skin's so good. <laughs> then your mind has the power to reconfigure things, send out good vibes to the rest of your body. Send the proper vitamins and minerals to your hair. This is all just by you, your brain, thinking something's gonna work. It can send these vibes out and things will work. So, it's not exactly the fact that sugar bear hair doesn't work, but it only works because you think it's gonna work. Mind blowing, I know. There's a lot of research about this. Um, placebos are nearly, almost, almost nearly as effective as real medicine. You can read a book about it. I've read many books about it. You can look up Trust me, it's a thing. Well, I hope you found that very entertaining at least. I mean, I don't know if it was informative, but definitely entertaining for sure. That is it, ladies and gentes. Sugar bear hair, if you got the money, cough it up because sis over here is ready to sell the fuck out for a million dollars. I'm ready for it. I'm ready to change my mind about your brand. Well, tune in next time for me on another brand's life. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to check out my life and whatever else. I don't know. I post dumb shit on Instagram and Twitter. If you want to follow me on there, cool. If you don't, guess what? Nobody's making you. Except I might make somebody show up at your door and, you know, get you to press that follow button. Because it'll, it's, you know, that was a threat, wasn't it? Thank you guys so much for watching today. Don't forget to live your shitty life and I will see you all next time. Peace. Did you catch that? Live your shitty life. I'm just kidding. Your life is probably much better than mine and happier and better. And fuck, I need a therapist.